This video is sponsored by Raycon. So can you tell the difference between when someone is flirting and when someone is just, like being nice? It's a common problem a lot of people have, including myself. But is that for a reason? And is it as cut and dry as people think? Well, uh, let's find out. So I'll be putting you guys and two of my friends through a couple, maybe they are, maybe they aren't flirting scenarios. And we'll see if you guys can get it right. Yo, so today I have brought uh, two wonderful guests here to uh, gauge their opinions. Oh, thank you. On on flirting, some flirting experts. Uh, I would consider myself a flirting expert. Anyone who makes Nintendo videos is a flirting expert. Sure, mm -hmm. Okay, you didn't have to go. You didn't have to do me dirty <laughs> like that. Oh, <laughs> so we have we have Get Mads here and uh, Doki Dora, other flirting expert. Sure. Anyone who talks about anime is also a flirting expert. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I don't. I learned mine from. Mario Bros. Yeah, um, imagine learning like flirting from Mario Bros. This is the same guy whose girl keeps getting kidnapped with heavy air quotes. Oh sh right. As you can tell, uh both these people here get plenty of pussy, as you can tell uh Thanks. from their conversations. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I don't know why oh, I just made that noise. I'm sorry. So how this will work, guys, is I will be presenting you two with scenarios, and you're going to tell me if you think they're flirting or if they're just being nice. Uh, the thing here with this one is that, yes, this is a very subjective topic, but there will be a definitive answer. But I mean, in other situation, it could be yes or no, but there will be a definitive answer in this situation. So y'all gonna tell me if it's a yes or no. And today we are doing this in my Discord server, a uh, light plug, where the Discord will be involved and we will be also seeing their votes on if it's flirting or not flirting. We are joined with about 50 people uh, who will be listening to this and giving their uh, hopefully better takes than ours. All right, here we go. First question. You go to a function with a group of friends and a person in your group compliments you on your outfit uh, and your hair, which you worked very hard on. Are they flirting or being nice? No. No. <laughs> you go out to a function. Well, first off, Kurt, I find it very hard to function myself as a human being. Yeah, I know you do, buddy. I live with you. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow I am functioning and they're complimenting me. I think that's just them feeling bad for me and, Jesus. and, and rooting me on for finally functioning Jesus. functioning as a human being. What? So Who hurt you? I would say that what? this is just someone being uh, proud that I'm being a bit more normal than usual. Interesting answer concerning response. <laughs> Dory? Um, well, I will I will agree with Mads that I think it is just being nice. It's not flirting. I mean, I guess kind of for different reasons because, like, I, I'm somebody who always, like, when I go out, tries to put myself together. I like to make my hair and clothes look nice just because, like... I always try to go out and flirt. I thought it's No, no, I don't... No, absolutely not. Uh, I don't want people talking to me ever, but... <laughs> ah. <laughs> um, but, like, so when I do go out, I, I always try to make a point of, like, making my hair and outfit look nice. And I've had lots Same. of friends, like compliment me before and that kind of stuff so it never really feels out of place or weird when somebody's like hey your dress is cute when like i mean facts are facts the dress is cute damn stun on these hoes okay mm, interesting all right i feel like everyone everyone feels very confident about this the chat is saying three votes yes 35 votes no and y'all are a little bit closer to that hypothetical trip to disneyland that is correct yes, yes. Uh, Yes. Oh, there! This is these are normal compliments. Uh, the three people who said yes, I I too am lonely. But just because they're being nice to you does not mean they're flirting. These are very like these are very basic things. Yo, you stun it on them. I hope you get a compliment, a very platonic compliment. Next, while talking to someone you just met, you tell a joke that makes them laugh, and they touch you on the shoulder and slide down. Flirting or being nice? Uh. While talking, you tell a joke. It makes them laugh. <laughs> Matt is just like, I've never made everyone laugh in my entire <laughs> life. <laughs> <laughs> I've never said anything funny ever. Dude, this isn't even a situation which can come to me. So, Dory, it's all you. Wow, wow. Uh, uh, I don't know, because I don't want to let, like, personal bias get in the way. Because, like, anytime, like, somebody uh -oh. gives me, like, a... I don't know, a shoulder touch or like a touch on the small of my back. I'm just like, oh, that's that's different. Don't know how I feel about that, but um For some reason this gives me like farmer. This gives me farmer vibes. I feel like what? I'm out on a farm. What did you just say? Farmer vibes? Far what the what are you talking about? Mads, where are you taking these questions? I'm like, you know, dragging the crops or whatever, putting down the carrot seeds, and then like 
farmer, farmer Charlie comes on and goes, ah, good one, bucko, and then slaps you on the shoulder. Mads has never been touched, so he has to be a farmer for this situation <laughs> to take place. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about that Ben 10 episode with the mummy. Oh. Like, you know, that farm. Like, I feel like you'd say a joke, you'd say a quip, and then Grandpa Max would, like, touch you on the shoulder and say, Oh, that was a good one. That brings me back to the days of making gumbo in space. I hope the answer isn't yes if it's uh. Grandpa Max. <laughs> no, I don't think it's Grandpa Max. Then it's the third answer, incest. Oh, my. <laughs> Sometimes, you know how, like, life imitates art? I, I know a few people, or I've seen a few people who, like, see how cartoons act or something. You know, like, <laughs> classic. Like, do that, and then they, they they lean on your shoulder and shake their head. Wait, wait, you think you think telling a joke and someone being like, oh, that's funny, and them tapping you on the shoulder is such a not real concept. Yeah. That it's in, it's in media. I have no idea what's, what's going, going on, on right here? now, but I'm going to act like I do. This is so unconceivable to man. No, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> No, it's not. You, you know how it is in the cartoons. I and know. The, and the media I know not. Like, so what is your answer? Right, right, what is like your answer, someone... Mads? No, it's not f***ing flirting. Because Grandpa Max laughing on my shoulder and saying classic is not a f***ing flirting. That's just him thinking I'm a funny quip. Oh, okay. All right, Dory, what do you think? Uh, I don't know. This one's kind of hard. I'm going to... Mm, I'll just say... I'll say not flirting for the not sake flirting. of like some people are just touchy. All right, so so let's 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 go to the Discord, see what the Discord thinks, and we have some LOLs and bras in there, uh, <laughs> as well as thirty six. It is flirting. Nine. It is not. Oh wow! So this is legit. The Discord versus uh, Dory and The Discord and discourse. The Discord versus the farmers. So. And the correct answer is... Oh, I'm sweating. It is flirting. Y'all are uh, wild, bro. This is not... Yo, Grandpa Max. What the f***, bro? <laughs> In what so situation is someone going to tap you on the f***ing shoulder and laugh and it be f***ing taken seriously? So let me explain this. This is a psychology thing. This is so the most corniest f***ing thing I've seen anyone do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've never had that happen to me. Matt tells... Wait, Matt tells a girl a joke and she laughs and, and she like, like, like brushes it. So like, oh, you're so funny. And he looks looks at her disgusted like you're so corny it's just oh. like in that cartoon <laughs> you're just like grandpa Max. Yeah, well it's like if they lean on you with one shoulder wait yeah, man let me explain your hands. let me explain why this is flirting before right. you go off All on right. your Fuck your it. manifesto, your manifesto. <laughs> uh, so Typically, when someone is flirting, they'll find a way to engage in the physical contact in a very small or subtle way. And it can be creepy sometimes. Yes. Yeah, Grandpa Thankfully, Max. the question isn't, is that kind of weird though? Uh, but it is, is it flirting? Uh, and in this situation, yes, the person uh, who did that was flirting. Yeah, with. okay. I guess I could get that because I don't really, I'm, I'm not touchy like at all, but like if I like somebody, I have occasionally like now nah, these people the, the people who made this fucking stupid list obviously do not understand social cues. Oh my god, have you never been touched by a woman after telling a joke, that man? That's not fucking flirting. <laughs> Mate, I'm just thinking about Grandpa Max when I read this. I know you people. are. I know you are, and it's kind of weird. We're gonna move on. Max, do you wanna... Weird? Come on! Alright, you can't <laughs> deny... I feel... <laughs> this is telling me you're a little attracted to Grandpa well, Max. Well, who wouldn't be? It's Grandpa fucking Max. Max wants to fuck <laughs> Grandpa Max. I'm having a great time. Alright, next up, next question. You two are engaged in conversation, and during conversation, they're nodding and smiling while listening, hitting you with, oh, wow, and really, they seem engaged, flirting or being nice. Oh, wow, really? I mean, people also say those things when they're bored of the conversation and they want to get out of it. Well, it depends on how long they say it, and like the times I feel like, oh, wow, oh, really? Oh, oh that's cool. Are they also asking like a lot of follow-up questions when you're talking? Do they seem really engaged? Like that's a, oh, that's a good point, Dory. Or are they just going, oh, wow? Really? They're definitely looking at you, and it seems like to what you're looking at that it seems like they're engaged. The the words they're saying are around the lines of "Oh wow" and "Really." I like the idea that they're saying "Oh wow, really," and then the camera slowly zooms into your head and it goes, "I have not a clue what we're talking about." <laughs> <laughs> you're on a date with Naruto. Okay, well I feel like if, like on the other side, I feel like if that person was trying to gauge if someone was speaking to you and you were trying to gauge if they were flirting or not. 
if they seemed interested in you and were actually listening and asking questions about your life and asking questions about you specifically, then I think that's more flirting and more them like trying to get to know you and be interested in like, you. Because it all depends on like the tone of voice they're using. And I'll say it right now. This will be the tone of voice. Oh, really? Wow. Oh, really? Like that. That tone of voice. Oh, okay. Because <laughs> like I could say... about those words, and they, it looks like they are listening. Okay, I will admit that gave me butterflies. <laughs> okay, this is flirting, but this is flirting in the like in the way where they are probably just they probably just want to get something out of it. You know, I feel like this is like more of flirting to get to the bedroom versus flirting to date the person. What is who like. hurt you? Because <laughs> they, they're not interested in the person. They're just saying, oh, wow, and really? That's so boring. Yeah. If you're actually interested in someone, you'd be asking them questions. Yeah. So yeah. what are y'all votes? What are y'all votes? Well, I mean, I feel like knowing how shitty these little fucking questions have been, this is going to be fucking... Yes, it is flirting. <laughs> Who do do? But in my personal opinion, it's fucking bad flirting. Yeah, this is flirting, I'm gonna... but it's bad flirting. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm going to have to agree with Matt. Oof. <laughs> Dory, what does that mean? What does that mean? <laughs> Just because I've been making references to sitcoms and Grandpa Max does not mean that my opinions are invalid, no. but I appreciate you. That's what, what is your final answer? Okay, you've uh, you've told me to go with my gut before, so I'm going to say no. Fuck. You know, I, it's like, shit. It's like, I need you to tell me what uh, you think. Fuck. Can I... You know, fuck it, just to be different, just to be different, I'm gonna go against against what Dory's saying, and I'm gonna say yes. But I do agree with Dory. I think it's not that good. So you're saying it's not good flirting? I personally believe that it's shit flirting. It's fucking good but, but it is flirting. flirting. So you're... You I'm asking that. you, do you think it's flirting? I'm not asking you if it's good flirting. Oh, I'm asking you, is yes. it flirting? I say yes. You say yes? So Dory's no, Mad's a yes? Okay. So the, the Discord chat's pretty split. Uh, at a 20, 20 vote yes and 28 vote no. Uh, oh. And the answer is, yes. it is not flirting. They're just listening to. Oh. They're a good listener. There's nothing to engage with. I knew there. it was. I knew it was. <laughs> I was trying to cheat the fucking system, and I fucking lost. What the? Fuck? I have never done this is... well on a quiz before. Yo, Yo Dory, so... this shit is fucking bullshit. Oh my god. <laughs> no, you literally said I you didn't think it was that. I'm so I happy I went with my gut. Flirting. It was terrible flirting. But I just decided to try and all. Oh, it's not flirting at all. The mm -hmm. people can, and that's the point of this question. Oh my people can listen to God. you and be engaged in you and not want to smash. Oh, yeah, hate, no, oh, that's the thing. Sometimes fucking... people are just nice. Yeah. Now there is a there is a level where when they're like really getting deep, they're like asking you deeper questions. They could be flirting, but they're just you know, hitting you with it. very basic. Oh wow, they're li they're just <laughs> listening, and there are people who are good listeners, so they're not flirting. I hate this. Now, I might be trash at knowing when girls are flirting with me, but you know what else is trash? A lot of headphones, a lot of, a lot of headphones and earbuds. So thankfully, I got the solution. Uh, the folks over at Raycon, I really hope they're cool with me using this image. This is, I think this is hilarious. Like, I'm telling y'all the folks over at Raycon are disrupting the electronics industry by designing the most premium wireless audio for only half the price. And when I tell you premium, I mean premium because the buds look great and they feel even better. See, something I love about Raycon is that they have customizable gel tips. Like, so you can get a fit for your ear. No more ear pain when I'm like at the gym. Like, why is my ear hurting more than like the set I'm doing? And they are built to stay in your ear and not make you look dumb. I've said this many a times, but I hate wired headphones when I'm at the gym because one time I was like lifting weights and they kind of just took me down. But with Raycon, that's not happening and they look good. These boys come in a variety of different colors, red, black, Kurt Ritchie, blue. It doesn't say that on the website, but I like to tell myself that. Plus they have six hours of playtime, seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and it comes with a charging case. Like, come on, come on guys. So if you want to get a hold of some Raycons and, you know, save a little moolah and help the channel, I'm going to go to buyraycon.com forward slash Kurt Ritchie, and then you'll get 15% off your entire Raycon order like the whole thing. So once again, go to buyraycon.com forward slash Kurt Ritchie to get 15% off your entire Raycon order. Thank you, Raycon. Oh, what's up, y'all? Yo, it's your boy, Dirty Room Richie. Yo, much love for checking out that video. Um, Yo, I like, I posted within a week, which is such a surprise to me. Like, good God. Um, Also, I'm in my underwear, so I'm not gonna real careful about this if you like that video please be sure to check out the last one it's about how i like kind of wanted to date a girl who's being a little racist but you know whatever 
<laughs> please check that out. It's a fun one. I hope you like more videos like this too. I like mixing them up. I think it adds like a cool style. So if you like these, keep letting me know. And uh, last but not least, as always, yo, big, huge thank you to the patrons. I can't do this without y'all. I yeah, literally, literally are. <laughs> thank you so much, guys. But um, really, that's all I got. Yo, thank you so much for being around. Uh, more videos to come. And uh, yeah, hope you guys look forward to it. Peace.